Hey guys, gals, friends, and pals, this is Paul Eastex Twitch, and welcome to another episode of Saturday Game School, where we learn about a different game where we learn about a different game every Saturday of the year. Tonight I'm joined on Mike by Tyler. Guys. And we've also got Brandon Cats off to the side. Hello. And tonight we are streaming Minute of Islands for Xbox. What a title, Tyler. It just rolls right off the tongue, doesn't it? Oh yeah. When I read it in the <laughs> when I read it in the newsletter, I was like, oh that's a that's a quite a name there. <laughs> and if the game lasts any longer than a minute, it's false advertising, I'd say. That's right. Minuet of Islands would be a better name. <laughs> so, Tyler, it seems that this game deals with trauma, anxiety, and destructive behavior towards oneself and others. And they spell behavior Britishly. Uh -huh. It also uses images and language that may be triggering or disturbing. So, a nice relaxing you... game to sit down with. <laughs> I love it, but... It's good to be considerate of people, but but when I see stuff like this, it like I don't know. It's just weird. It makes me like dread what I'm about to experience. <laughs> See that? So there's a map. Oh, it's fading in. Okay, if you f plug in a headset, it turns off HDMI audio. Yeah, that is bad. Weird. Dark Six, what would you say is your coolest feature? Besides being uh -huh. generous and donating codes to the stream every now and then. Uh -huh. They're just saying, they're uh -huh. speaking in gibberish, Tyler. Maybe they are the ones who named it uh -huh. Minute of Island. <laughs> it uh -huh. might make sense. By a town by a Minute of Island. Yeah. Got 60 seconds of island, baby. I like to say it is Island. <laughs> is that a thing in Utah, Tyler? Oh, yeah, that's how we say it here. Just like origin and such. It's because they don't have any. Uh, the origin of that is Lands saying. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, Dark Six, I instructed Icky that we have to give that code out this week. So, guys, if anyone has know. Steam and you don't own Need the game. No the puzzle game we're giving out, just take it, okay? It doesn't count against you for entering any of the other contests. What game? Yeah, what is the game, Icky? Or or Dark Six? Could somebody say the title of the game? It's like Minic Solins or something? Mickey Dolins, I think? Peter Tork? I'm not sure. Okay, things are happening. we got some beautiful 2D visuals. <laughs> yeah, it, it is a weird name. The Molek Sintens, that's what I said. Yeah, that, I believe that was the fourth monkey. Interesting. More has learned to sleep under the hissing that's the, that's the actor from Mr. Robot, right? <laughs> you might be right. That show is misleading. I hear there's no robots in it. Well done. It's also weird. I only made it like three episodes in. Gotcha. Yeah, I just don't like when they have like kind of a fantastic or interesting title, but then it's not that thing doesn't literally appear in the show or movie. Nothing startles her more. Yeah, you, you, know, must, you must have hated Black Panther. It actually didn't have any Panthers in it. Uh, it had Panther statues. But no, like there's, for instance, yeah, there's, there's no a, a movie called right. The Gollum or something like that, and there's no Gollums in it. And it makes you think it's going to be cool. That's yeah, not... exactly. I, I want to see those fantastic elements. Don't use a fantastic name if your movie's not fantastic. Anyway. Use what left. It's fantastic to somebody else. Well, I mean, fantastic as in having fantasy elements. But anyway, why does oh, it say damn. use left trigger plus left trigger to move? It's Amaranth's birthday. Happy oh. birthday, Amaranth! Yeah, I hope your low stress life of luxury is going well for you. <laughs> She's opening gifts from viewers. Oh God! She got a Disney coloring book. <laughs> How nice. Yeah. Now, I have put That'll it out there. Wet in the hot tub. Actually, I mean, I put it out there to the audience that I would like a new headset, but I they don't really have a way to give it to me unless they're already on the inner circle, so I'm probably not going to get a new headset. How come Adriana Chechich isn't on my recommended channels? Is that even a she real name? She, she only games. She doesn't even she doesn't even do hot tub streams. That's probably why. <laughs> well, uh, that makes her cooler in my opinion she but broke her back in switch. two places at twitchcon oh geez that's the person yeah 
Ooh, look at that. I drew this thing out. Just Google her. Hey, Lady Magritte, it's nice to see you. What a cool visitor to have tonight. <laughs> That's true. Tyler has no time to play games because he's too busy watching hot tub streams. Hold it to draw the Omni Switch. It will give away your next objective like a compass and give you access to the machines of the giants. Tyler, this is kind of an intricate world we're experiencing here. It reminds me of Dark Crystal or something. Um, is that the one with the little creatures? Yeah, you know, they, the Skeksis. Is well, the they, the Skeksis weren't little. Yeah, they're actually huge. Those those weird guys that lumber around? Yeah, and they're like... How they what's, talk? Little, what's a little fuzzball called? <laughs> oh, I don't remember what the fuzzball was uh, called. Does anybody? Fizz, Tyrania fizz, probably would know. Fizzwig. Fizzwig? Yeah, fizz. yeah, there is something, something like, like that. that. She was also pregnant. So not only is she rich, but... Oh, oh, no, Chicago's not talking about Fizzgig. Amaranth. He's talking about the injured girl. I was going to make a joke. I was yeah. like, not only is she rich, but she's getting some action, too. Anyway. <laughs> it's Fizzgig. Like Lady McGreed says. Fizz... Oh, Fizz gig, nice. Good recollection there. Brandy loves a dark crystal or two, don't you? I love it. <laughs> I didn't watch the new series, but I watched the old movie. We watched like half of the new series and we uh, fizzled out. Yeah, I remember you talking about it one time. Watch some of it. Jump. It's, I mean, it's really well made. I don't know if it, does anyone know if the Netflix series of Dark Crystal actually resolves the story? Because Netflix loves to cancel shows, you know before they finish their serialized stories. That's like their main thing. That's what you subscribe for, one season of stuff. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, Sperry says they canceled it, so that means they did not... Oh, by the way, hi, Sperry. Did I say hi to you yet? Yeah. But anyway... Oh, cool. There's here? a lurk command. I want to do it now. More hey, but it was really well made, and it also had Mark Hamill voicing the character, and that's and always good. Built. But Tyler, you shouldn't be lurking. He used the full. I just wanted to use the command. <laughs> when are we going to get a shout out command? That's what I want to know. Unlurk. Oh, there is an unlurk. Look. Whoa, look at that. This game is pretty amazing artistically. It's a shame we have a stream format that doesn't encourage great paying attention to the story. <laughs> Very variable. Ah, what the heck? That's a good-looking guy. Kind of looks yeah. like Paul. Oh, like me? Wow. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'll take that as a compliment, Tyler. A lot <laughs> is it the like a hot tub, Spazpol asks? We're glad you're here, Spazpol. Maybe he has a good, uh, maybe he has a good person. This has got to be European, because the just the art style and the, the like technology and stuff is deeply interesting. Well, Sperry, Sperry Berry Boy's even heard of it. <laughs> I'm impressed by it so far, Sperry. Back in the day, I used to be up on all my indie games, but that was a long time ago. Before there were a million billion of them? Exactly. That's yeah. that's that's the main reason why I got burnt out on trying to keep track of them. You can't tell just by the name whether it's like a 30-second platinum cheap game or a real game. No, you can't. And this game, very misleading. So far, it's lasted much longer than a minute. Uh -huh. Yep. He was always the weakest <laughs> before. Any fast fall back trying to breathe. Even more, <laughs> Spaz pool, ASMR is, is lame. That's all it I can say about it. No offense to anyone who likes it, but it's lame properly. and you should get better at it. But nothing does without the engine. Yeah, it's not a... it's stupid. Except for when they have, like, the little ear thing on the microphone and they lick it. That's the best. <laughs> oh, Tyler. I know you like that for some reason. Yeah, like, do I want to watch... Do I want to listen to somebody chewing and licking their lips and crap? I, I don't really. Uh, Spaz yeah, what if it's a hot babe? Even if she's hot, I'd rather watch her do hot things than something stupid and pointless. That's, that would be better for me. Okay, I could go up there. But I'm going to look over here first. Let's ask Lady Magritte. She's not here that, all that often. Lady Magritte, what do you think of ASMR? Uh oh, Icky likes it when it's well done. He says, oh, "Sinua's." Yeah. Wait, is he talking about Hellblade? Sinua's sacrifice. Oh, good luck on the contest, everybody. Oh, look, I can shimmy. Why does it say left trigger plus left trigger? That still makes no sense. Just push it, it twice. I think it's supposed to be left trigger or D pad, maybe, because the D pad does let you move. Oh, I asked, "What do you think of ASMR?" As some people. 
record themselves making chewing sounds and playing with wrapping playing with wrapping paper and things and other people listen to it on purpose yeah and they like to whisper a lot too they make you feel like you're special that doesn't make me feel special like I would only feel guilt if I listened to it on purpose you feel guilt yes I would just feel like I'm wasting my time well How come she doesn't have arms things. I think her arms are in the shirt because they do. She can Pullers. climb. They See, they come out. out. Yeah. So, or maybe they're just oh, retractable arms. Not really sure how that works. Oh, they do kind of retract under a scarf or something. Oh wow, she knows some of the science behind it. I didn't realize you were so well read. That's kind of cool. Okay, is that an eye or something else? I think it's an ear. The observatory is not much um, use. Okay, if you say so. <laughs> Thank you. Without least... power, the observatory is not much use. <laughs> That's too bad. Well, at least you didn't say it was anything inappropriate, Tyler, so I appreciate right. that. Right. It's a PG-13 stream, or it's a PG stream. Hmm, I think we're more PG-13 in general, except that we don't. We try not to cuss, but... PG-12. <laughs> that means PG, PG-13 means I get to say the F word one time per stream. <laughs> oh, no, you're right. We're, we're slightly below that. <laughs> okay. All right, got to draw my stick. Boom. Um, okay, but what do I do after I draw it? Put it into the ear. Well, I could try. Guys, don't encourage Tyler to say the F word. <laughs> I'm not going to say the F word. <laughs> You little BX, freaks. BX Latino, he isn't impressed, Tyler. Right, lock in. What does that mean? Oh, I, I could stick my... I just stuck it in a hole. I don't See? Care. That's not fair. See? <laughs> I can't say the F word. <laughs> no yeah. power. Well, well, I mean, if you think of how many millions of people there are, Spazpole, that's still a very small niche. Like, like people who are into feet. Yes, Dark Six. I stuck it in the hole, okay? Give me a break. What am I supposed to do now, though? Go do it again. Do it. It's got to be something with that draw. Lock in. R, R, but I, B. I already did it once. I don't think but... you did it right. Maybe you undid it. Okay, let's find out. Oh, I have to crank it. I see. Okay. Um, got to fill up the meter. Yeah, maybe it was the wrong hole, Chicago. I have no follow-up jokes to that. All right, but we turned the power on, so that's good. Still no power? How is there still no power? Now go stand up there. All right, right trigger plus left trigger. At least it's good with the on-screen. Telling you what to do. Yeah. yeah. Well, you're probably gonna have to remember them for later. Ah, move probe. What am I? I don't know what I'm doing. Put it in his ear. This reminds me of the... Did anybody ever watch the Brothers Grunt on MTV? It reminds me of that a little bit, even though it's not no. as gross. Pump it. But, yeah, I mean, it had weird stuff like this, where it's just, like, weird... Why is it so bizarre? But, hey. It hits more like Aeon Flux had weird stuff. Oh, yeah, it, it did. Forward. Yeah, I mean, it's from the same era of MTV, Tyler. At the same time. Hmm. Yeah, I don't, that one doesn't ring a bell. Way to go, Vinny BT. Did we give away Molex Sintez yet? Heard. Somebody take that game, please. Inspect the surface. Okay, do I just walk up to it? They aren't powering their engines. The islands are unprotected. We can't have that. This is right. Wait, but Icky, the, I mean, the instruction was to give it away in round one. Icky, are you not reading the, the order thing? Oh, well. That's okay. Icky is very awesome and generous with his time. Save it for the Christmas stream, but yeah, nobody will give it away. I mean, nobody will take it then, Dark Six. It'll still just sit around. You know, we probably have like 15 Steam codes from last Christmas that we haven't even used. <laughs> Everyone loves Steam. Steam is truly great, especially now you that you're Steam. You can play it on your Steam Deck. <laughs> yeah, but things that are not controller optimized well, are not good on Steam Deck. Yeah, so. it's too toxic to breathe. And just as more Spouse full song will take it. Okay. The poison is kept out. Oh, I did? It came my bad, I'm sorry. Um, but Icky, would you give whatever that is to Spaz Pulsum? We can just give it to him, I don't care. 
not having a code sit around for three weeks, Tyler. That's shameful. Yeah. Have we put off PC gamers in some way? Is that the problem? You know, like they all left. Um, I don't know. Mace was a Mace was a PC gamer, and you scared him off. I did, man. I was nothing but nice to him. Didn't Brian used to be a big PC gamer? Yeah, Still Brian is. did. But, well, not anymore. Brian decided he doesn't like playing on PC anymore. I, I don't understand it. Oh. Hey, some things lit up. Now what? Pump. Are those things good or bad? No, I don't want to pump. I think I There's have to just... There's a special room them. just for pumping. Yeah, you're not supposed <laughs> to pump. That doesn't ah. happen in boys. Um, Sorry. You have to pump so that... No, can't make any weird jokes. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah, Thyrenia has... It up. Yeah, I did screw it up. I don't understand what I was even supposed to be doing, though. Did I you? guess not touch those things. But how was I supposed to move on to the right? That's what I want to know. Go when it's behind the thing. What is oh, vibrating? That makes more sense. My controller? Okay. Controllers, nowadays, they a lot but of them vibrate. That, the, that PlayStation one doesn't, but... It's vibrating the whole table for some reason. PlayStation 1 doesn't vibrate? Tyler, you were Parker's. so right. Or it could have been my phone vibrating from a notification because it's on the table. Yeah, it doesn't look like we that's a floor you can walk on. It looks like a pit. Yeah, exactly. So it hadn't even occurred to me. Oh, yeah. I got to the whale level. <laughs> oh, look. It's colorful outside. That's nice to see. Yeah, more than a couple colors. So, Tyler, we've been watching the new Willow show. You haven't checked it out, have you? No. You haven't even seen the original movie, have you? No. Tyler... Isn't Ron, isn't Ron Howard in that? Ron Howard is the director. Oh. Which, he's is not... Is it about a be... mouse? No, it's not about a mouse. Oh. It's about oh. Warwick Davis, who is a dwarf or something. Oh. It's not horrible at all, Spazpole. There's nothing horrible about it. It's very well made and fun and has a wonderful score by James Horner. Like, it's very good, so I'll never understand why anybody would say things like that. Yeah, he's a guy who wants to be a wizard, Warwick Davis. <laughs> R2-D2 is in Willow. Well, technically, is Warwick Davis... No, Warwick Davis is Ewok. Uh, he's Wicket, the Ewok. Yeah. He's and he also does, a sc does the score, you said? He's also Profes Professor Flitwick. Oh, he wants to be a sorcerer. My bad. Oh, yeah. Professor... Flitwick. From Harry Potter? From Harry Potter. So it's kind of like Ratatouille, where there's a mouse that wants to be a chef. This is a mouse that wants to be a sorcerer. <laughs> Tyler, we can't call him a mouse. <laughs> I thought it was about. I thought it was about it mice. What's the movie that's about mice? A down. Ratatouille. No, there's another one. The the yeah, yeah. no, it's not Stuart Suffer. Little. No, I mean, Stuart Little is about a mouse. Yeah. Oh, you mean the witches? That's Based not about a mouse. Doll book? Yeah, there's a boy who gets turned into a mouse. Oh, is there? Yeah. I read that book in third grade. He never gets cured. He stays a mouse forever for the rest of his life. It's not Fievel. It's like a... Oh, yeah, an American Tale. It's like a... It's not a cartoon. It's like a CGI mouse. And there... It's like a fantasy movie show with a mouse. The Tale of Despero? Is that it? Wasn't it know. Despero is a story about a mouse and he's like a musketeer or something? Wolf Blade, who is a cat, not a mouse? <laughs> well, yes, this game is longer than a minute. However, it is really pretty and interesting, so I can't complain about that. Like, look at all this lovely 2D artwork. Is, it, is Watership Down about a mouse? No, that's about rabbits, and I've oh. never seen it. I remember Adam liked that story, if I recall. This is where the smell was coming from. Yeah, it's a bunch of dead fish and stuff. Movies about mice. <laughs> The spores did not spoil the crustaceans. Oh, the tell of Despero, that's what you were talking about. I, yeah, I said it. So not that was that. it? Oh, the, no, that's Nim. not that one, though. Secret of Nim? Yeah, Secret okay. of Nim is great. I've never seen that one. Why didn't they get a proper sequel instead of a crappy made for video one that nobody likes? Remember The Great Mouse Detective? That was a good movie about mice. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. There's spores everywhere, and they're bad. A glimpse of the other islands, not far from here. 
It takes maybe about it was a minute. Ma maybe it was Watership Down and it was Rabbits. Ah, I'm going the wrong way. That was a Disney classic. Spazpole. Secret of Nim is not a Disney classic. It was animated by Don Bluth. I'm not sure which studio he animated it for, but anyway. Filthy chair with her uncles behind him printed into it. Does this mean like her whole family has died or something because of these weird spores? I mean, what? It just it seems like a horror movie scenario. There's one of those vagina things. The ventilation system. The widow should have gotten on. How am I going to cleanse the air? Well, yeah, it's you know now. Mice. Maybe it's forest creatures. He knows now that I told him. Way to play it off, Spazpool. <laughs> Just teasing him. These bottled messages never left the islands. Oh, what's that say? Fishing, sitting around, doing nothing. Yeah, no, you're right. Great Mouse Detective. That was a fun movie. Yeah, I like that movie. I like when they set up the big trap and he's gonna he's gonna escape from it at the last second. It's funny. Ooh. I think you would like Willow. It's not like you probably won't find it as amazing as somebody who lived through that era, but um, I still bet you'd like it. So, man, I have no idea where to go. Like Mo, these bottled messages never left these islands. I think, you, yeah, you pull out that staff and it points at you where you're supposed to go. Okay, on the neighboring island of Bewa. I have to get to the neighboring island of Bewa or something. Is that like a... Oh, it, you're right, it does... It's got a little arrow, doesn't it? And it always yeah. points that way no matter which way you're facing. That's interesting. Okay, we'll try. I'll let it lead me around. Gosh, this art is lovely. Yay, no time for games. Thank you, and it's good to see you. Why don't you jump down? Um, can I jump down over there? Let me test that. I don't think I can. It's odd. You can't just jump down everywhere. It's only when there's a... Oh, it has to have, like, a painted, I see. Yeah, like this ledge here, we can climb up or down, but only it. Okay. Well, let's just keep following the thing. Black Cauldron. That was a fun movie, and the Blu-ray apparently has really bad DNR, so nobody likes it, so I haven't bought it. I wonder if that's true of the Disney Plus version of it. But anyway, Tyler, Willow the movie is DNR. on Disney Plus. Yeah, digital noise reduction. Oh, that's just like, do not resuscitate. <laughs> I know. I was sitting there going, DNR, DNR order. What's DNR? Don't save it. Yeah, no. Like that. In a misguided attempt to improve picture quality on Blu-rays and above, the uh, studios will often apply too much DNR, which results in a smudgy, blurry image that is not pleasing to anyone. That's not good. There's a dead whale. Yeah, and poison peacocks. Poison seagulls, whatever they're called. Oh, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> poison peacocks. Oh, wow, Lady McGrath has read the books. Yeah, I knew it was based on some books. It's too bad the movie didn't do well. Black I did Cauldron. see the... Yeah, I saw that the, the movie theater. with mice. No, no mice. Are you That's sure? That's King Arthur. <laughs> Tyler, you think everything's a movie with mice. King Arthur. King Arthur? In the yeah, Black Cauldron? Yeah, Squire. He pulls a sword. But no, wait. That's the wrong one. No, I'm that's the Sword in the, the Stone. stone. Yeah. Sword in the Stone is cool. That has... Yeah. Agamemnon, what's Ag Ag uh, Artemis, 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 Artemis yes. Owl. Yes, the owl, the owl is awesome. Yeah. Rescuers? And the, I'm the, the, the bad lady is awesome too. It's not, it's not a cartoon movie, it's like a CG movie, but I think it might have been Watership Down and I was confusing rabbits and mice. Watership Down is not with... a CG movie, it's 2D animated. Oh, then it's not that. I swear I saw a movie and it, it was like, it was like some weird, I don't know, they were going down a river, and there was like a, a mouse and another mouse, and it wasn't cartoony. I, was like, I th there's... thought it was called Willow. But maybe it was another, it was some type of forest animal. I was like, the rescuers has, the, they're floating down a river on a leaf. Not rescuers. I know the rescuers very well. They fly on the bird. Yeah, and by the way, it's kind of amazing that the rescuers got a sequel like 15 or 20 years later. Like, uh... Yeah, it was really weird. Yeah, because Disney didn't even do very many sequels back then. When they went to, to Australia? Yep, down under. 
I believe Jono appears in the background of one of the scenes. Anyway. So that's Willard. Pause. What's Willard? Oh yeah, Willard is like a creepy thriller slash maybe horror grabber. movie about a guy who can control rats or something. No, it wasn't that, but I think there's even a remake of it. <laughs> Thank you, Jonah. Awesome, so weird. You're always in my heart, buddy. Do not worry. There's been I'll fix, fix your mess, and I will save our Mr. Homes. Back to the Future. More reassures herself. But only the first one, because apparently he was too crazy, so they didn't bring him back for part yeah, two. Yeah, I heard that, that he had to have, like, a handler or something. Yeah, he's like a real eccentric, difficult person. Alright. Should I leave the island? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Let me pull out my thing. Is it, it the, is... wind in, the Wind in the Willows? Is that a movie? A stop-motion animated movie, isn't it? Alright, let's leave the island. Thank you. Tyler, I'm trying to talk about Willow, and all you're getting is... All you're doing is making people think of random animated films. <laughs> Mostly it's with not animated films. <laughs> Yeah, there was a frog. And we got an achievement. Yo! And Wanted... nobody said Cinderella. Cinderella has mice. It. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it does. Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. Yep. Yeah. So, anyway, Willow is a good movie, and you should watch it. It is very fun. Val Kilmer is great in it. That can't and... possibly be true. <laughs> what do you mean? He, he was very good in the late 80s and early 90s. Yeah. He's also in Top Gun, your favorite good. movie about jets. Oh yeah, the one where Goose dies. He was not Goose. Spoiler alert. Yeah, also, yeah, we don't do that to us. But he wasn't Goose, he was a guy who lives. Oh. But Goose comes back to secure Uh, that's a good question. I bet the actor who played Goose is like, has sour grapes about not being a sequel if he's not, which he probably isn't. Or goose. Oh, you haven't seen it? I thought you. Oh, no. you bought it. But you yeah, I bought it, but haven't watched it yet. Yeah, it's on our to-do list. We saw it. No, the sequel we didn't. We, we saw it. No. We watched part one, and then we watched Hot Shots. Despite Hot Shots is very fun. She sure didn't want to watch it, but anyway. And the then we movie. No, Hot Shots is a parody of Top Gun, and also of, of just like. Oh, okay. Things. That's right. And then we we have not watched Top Gun two yet. We need to. What's the Hot hockey Shots movie called? The Mighty Ducks? No, it's a spoof movie too. Oh, I don't know that then. A few violent coughs. Hmm. A few eerie apparitions. Oh, we'll Hot. From doing her What's job. Hot Shots has After Charlie me. Sheen in it? She yes. Is the bear yeah, and he's not a good person, but he was fun in that movie. You know, he was like he was in a lot of fun things back in the days. Mad Mardigan was awesome. It's one word, Chicago. Interesting spelling there, but yeah. It, great character and that's a good question how am I liking the Willow series so far it is fun now unfortunately being a modern show it has much less color than the original movie Brandy and I have talked about this because I can't shut up about it but like modern shows Tyler they make them super blue and orange and modern movies too so like there was a little bit of that in older movies but they like they really amp it up in modern stuff so there's just so much less color and it's the worst in Disenchanted. If anybody watches the movie Disenchanted, just watch how orange that movie is. Her orange hair just blends in with the background. It's so friggin' orange. But anyway, yeah, so Willow, the show, like I said, a little bit less color than it should be, but it does have the actress who plays Sorsha, which is Matt Morgan's wife in it. That's pretty awesome. And Willow, he's in it. And it's, uh, so far it is a fun fantasy adventure. It does not feel as big and theatrical as the original movie did. But, you know, interesting creatures and bad guys and things, and we're looking forward to seeing where the story goes, right? What did you think, Brandy Bell? Um, I liked it. I don't like the conflict between Willow and Sorsha very much. Between Willow and Sorsha? I understand why it's there, but... It's just to explain things away but I guess we don't want to talk too much specifically yeah. about the story but yeah like that's true it's and just a I bit of a really downer. I'm having a hard time liking that one girl the the lot. princess yeah yeah there is Sorsha's daughter 
is one of the main characters and she's a bit unpleasant but we're only two episodes into the show it's not like wednesday where they release the whole season and she starts out pretty unlikable in wednesday and she becomes a little bit more likable by the end but although every everyone else in the show loves her except for a few of the antagonists but anyway uh, yeah there's a princess and she's she's jealous and pompous and a bit annoying a bit. remember yeah a bit <laughs> a smidge Spiritfarer, what is that? I haven't seen that. But Tyler, Tyler, am I to take it that you don't really like fantasy things? Is that what you're telling me? It's on PlayStation Extra. I need to start playing it. it looks oh, cool. Yeah. Have Might you played well. it in Chicago? It sounds awesome. Um, <laughs> I fantasy is not. Yeah, it's definitely not my like go-to genre. The children used to all come here together. Well, one thing that makes the movie Willow so special yeah. is that yeah. there were barely the any friends. theatrical fantasy well, movies we'll in the nineteen eighties. You know, the like, there's a few, but they're like few and far between. And then the so happened. that's kind of a fun thing, you know. Like now, I mean, it's sort of like superhero movies. You know, now superhero movies are very common, but back in the day, there were barely any. You know, and so that's one thing that I like about it, I guess. But I suppose I am predisposed to like it anyway. Yeah, there you go, Chicago. For all, uh oh, what did it say to do? Locate and restart the first of the things. Tyler, is your is your problem with fantasy movies that they don't have enough hot tubs in them? Yeah, there's usually none. Once in a while, there's Who a good hot there's that. a good hot springs or something that they run into when they go into the, the forest. Or fills her nostrils. Did You're right. Lord of the Rings? Did Lord of the Rings have a hot spring? <laughs> I don't know. That's a good question. They there was something. Down there was something where, like, they were. <laughs> they, they, it's like two mice, and they're trying to get away. Maybe like the, the town is being invaded or something. The forest oh. is being chopped down. No, and they're trying to escape. You're thinking of flushed away, from Arden <laughs> Animation. <laughs> flushed away. Starring, yeah, starring Hugh Grant. No, isn't it Hugh Grant? No, it's Hugh Jackman. Hugh, Hugh, Hugh Jackman. Hugh Laurie. Is it Hugh? It's not starring him. Is no, it? Hugh, I don't know. Hugh Laurie is in Stuart Little. I think. Oh, could be. Yes. Doing his Doctor Strange voice. Actually, Doctor Strange copied Hugh Laurie's voice. Did he? No. No, yeah. You know, like House. That's Hugh Laurie, isn't it? Yeah, House copied uh, Sherlock. No, no. I don't think he did, did he? But my point was, Doctor Strange, Benedict Cumberbun, he copies <laughs> Hugh Laurie's voice, uh, his House voice. They're the same Oh, voice. really? I never yeah. thought. I never noticed. I'll have to pay attention to that. Yeah, I really think so. Uh, what that's, is how, this? that's how he learned to do American. Where they're, where they're both British, so maybe. Yeah. That's why you chose him to follow. <laughs> There's dead animals and stuff, and they're being killed by spores. I mean, it's what an interesting dark world this is. Tyler imagined so long ago. Did you see the movie Dark World? Dark? Don't you mean Dark City? Maybe I mean Dark City. What no, is... I thought there was a Dark World with like two girls or something. Dark World. Oh, Spice World, right? About the Spice Girls? Yeah, Spice World. That's what it was. Of course. Must... <laughs> Boy, Dark World is the Thor movie, huh? Yeah. No, Dark City is the movie where people are trapped in a city that's always night and weird things yeah. happen to them at night. There's no. bald guys who mess with them while they're asleep and all kinds of good things. Not oh. what I'm thinking of. I, I should probably... Names yeah, it, it couldn't hurt. <laughs> you're, like, you're like Brandy's daughter. Brandy's daughter cannot remember titles of things we watch. Like That's we watch funny. all these things, and she'd be like, "I'd never seen that." It's like, yeah, we watched it. Moore's heart skips a beat. So, have any of you guys in the audience watched Willow? I was interested in knowing what other people thought of it as well, since poor Tyler hasn't seen it and probably won't for a long time. Probably not. Mr. Book and Mr. Hand, are they from Dark Dark City? It's been a few too many years since yes, I've seen it. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Yeah, because, I mean, I love that movie, but I haven't seen it since Brandy and I started going out. We've been going out for quite a while. I think Dark City is what I was thinking of. Really? Even though I described it and you said it wasn't that? This place. I just heard it's you good and then I never watched it. Oh, it's great, yeah. 
Nice, Chicago. That's good to hear. Chicago, how did you like Wednesday? Like, One I think night, Wednesday is a pretty months. good show. You liked it, didn't you, darling? I loved it. Is it, a, is it over? Yeah, it, well, Wednesday is a Netflix show, so... Oh, yeah, they the still release thing. everything at once? Usually, yes. So you could watch Willow if, all at once, too, if you wanted. No, no Willow is Disney+. Plus. Disney Plus. Oh, why did I think that was on Netflix? Yeah, but remember, Tyler, there's a movie of Willow, so you should just watch the movie and see what you think, and then you would know if you wanted to watch the show or not. Willow so. I or won't I? <laughs> Tune in next week to find out. <laughs> I guess we'll have to. It'll be a nice break from digging trenches in your backyard. Yeah. Oh, because he, like me, is very excited for River City Girls, too, but he expresses I'm Building my own river, yeah. Yeah. It smells of candy floss, popcorn, and frying fat. It seems like everybody got killed from this stuff pretty recently in the story. Oh, you know, like, how it said it deals with self-harm? Do you think it's people getting infected by the spores and so they kill themselves? Because I bet that... I bet it's pretty awesome. horrible. Probably. Yeah. There's a T. What's the TV show called? You know, because I'm so good with TV with names. <laughs> Severance. Chicago. Severance. Yeah, Severance. Oh yeah, that, we still need to watch that. It has that warning. That's like a spoiler for the episode. That kind of pissed me off. Oh yeah, that that's a drag. Chicago asks she, how you dead. are going it to get a river resting. with no water. Chicago. Tyler actually lives in Utah. He's not local yeah, to me. Sadly, we also have no water, but. Else, I still believe. <laughs> that's true. You can just imagine. We have some snow here, but it doesn't yeah, that's create crazy. enough water. You get more snow than we do. Well, yeah, Utah yeah. gets a lot more snow than Texas. I mean, Utah's a desert. It doesn't make any sense. There's I mean, high it's deserts. it's not, and we're yeah, we're about four thousand feet up. I got we got slow. I I lived in New Mexico. We got snow every winter. Don't you get scared being that high up, Tyler? Uh, sometimes you just don't look down oh got it got it jonah watch severance yeah it's really good it's really worth a watch there are deserts that have snow yearly well yeah that's more often than we get snow here in my part of texas we get it once every five to ten years i would say which is vegas is more of a desert than salt lake huh that makes sense and this is a creepy place i'm exploring I like that it got a little bit more color. Yeah. She kind of looks like Coraline. Oh, yeah, you're right. She does. Which, by the way, is coming out in 4K Blu-ray this month. And I've got that pre-ordered. I've never seen look. it. Oh, Tyler, you really should. It's great. I heard it's, it's good, yeah. That one yeah. is that one is on me for not having seen it. There's no reason I haven't seen it. It looks good and sounds I good. S well, I saw it in the theater, so I've got you double beat. Hey, there's someone spamming in the <laughs> chat. What? Seriously? Ah. Regl Reglanarum. Wanted oh, to offer man. promotion of your channel, viewers, followers, views, chatbots. The price is lower. Ooh, good price. Oh, Can't we launch him into space? Hit with oh, the do I... So should I make him a mod? <laughs> Tyler. I thought he had a weird name. It turns out he's not even human. I don't know how to delete any of this stuff. I'll click on his name and just ban him. I think it might automatically delete what he said. Oh. I know I need to go up high, but I didn't see how to actually get up there. I guess we'll find out. Lock and report. I can ban. Thank you. Oh, Shitsu took care of it. Shitsu, yeah, you're the man. Figure it out. Way to outdo Tyler yet again, Shitsu. It didn't. It didn't <laughs> give me the option to ban. It just said lock and report. That's weird, because you're you're also a mod. Yeah, I got a sword next to my name. Can anyone figure out how I can get up high? Because I'm really not seeing it. Uh, jump. Yeah, well, I mean, I am, but there's only certain places you can climb. Look, it that's got the snowy ledge over it like you could climb on it, but I, firstly, I can't actually jump that high. See? Yeah. Can't oh, it's not high. a, you don't, it's not a word. It's just a circle with a cross through it. Oh, okay. Okay, I didn't realize it was <laughs> a button. It's fast pull, what the heck? This is a family-friendly stream, Spazful, so we actually, <laughs> although we do support the legalization of things that shouldn't be illegal, we do not encourage people to partake. Yeah, we think that opium should be legal in America. <laughs> yeah, we're fighting for that. Yeah. Not. <laughs> Where does Spazful live? Um, 
He lives in the New East New somewhere. York? Not New York. Wasn't it Virginia or something? Massachusetts. Massachusetts. Is that uh, even a real state? They got a bunch of commie lefties up there. No wonder it's legal. <laughs> Tyler, that's wrong. Anyway. Oh, boy. This is frustrating me. It looks like maybe I have to climb from down below. Let me try going down below and seeing if there's a way. This is interesting. So, Tyler, I understand there's a trailer for a new Guardians of the Galaxy movie of some sort. Yeah, it's called Willow. <laughs> I don't think it's called Willow. Oh, it's called Guardians of the Galaxy 3. Finally, I figured it out where to go. Guardians of the Galaxy. Guardians with a Vengeance, I think That's is what right. you call the third one. Armageddon 2. Armageddon. <laughs> Still Armageddon. Um, yeah, there is. There's a trailer. Actually, a lot of trailers came out, and they announced that Mandalorian is coming in March, too. Ooh, nice. Um, but yeah, there was that <laughs> trailer. There was another trailer, Super Mario trailer. We can make fun of that later. Oh, I think I just made a new platform. Yay. Yay. Oh, yeah, I haven't actually watched that, because like, my interest in it is very low because of Chris Pratt, unfortunately. Which yeah, is... I've, I've really soured on Chris Pratt as well. Which is sad because he's funny in Parks and Rec. Parks and Rec, yes. And he's, I mean, he's good in Guardians, wouldn't you say? In the Guardians series. Yeah, yeah. I, d I don't know where, I don't know why I lost it, but he's well, kind of just I mean, comes off as a dunker. Douchey. Yeah, but also, yeah. like, everyone knows that he is miscast as Mario. Like, there is nobody who thinks he's the right voice for yeah, Mario. Yeah, that was silly. That was just like, uh, hey, here's a big name. We can give a lot of money and he'll be famous and do a voice for us. Yeah, and I think it's really hurting his reputation. Like, it's hurting how much people like him, because I like him less because he was miscast as Mario, and I, I don't think I'm the only one. I mean, that I, whole, like, Jack Black, that I think does, like, but Jack Black is doing a voice for Bowser. It's nice that he's doing a voice. We've talked about this so many yeah. times about celebrities, like, just don't do voices, you know? Like, yeah, when they, Charlie uh, Day is not doing a voice at all, either. And yeah, Peach's, which isn't great. Peach's voice really is not good either. But Mario's the main guy, so that's what we focus on. Right, right. No dare to for? take a deep breath. The buzzing the is driving to death. death. But the accurate I'm voice is not gone. detecting a buzzing. To go. That's right, there was a new Transformers trailer too. Like he mentioned. Chicago says he doesn't feel like he's even played a... Oh yeah, I didn't get to watch it. But Chicago doesn't feel like he's even played a Mario game. And that may not be accurate, you know? Like... And he could be the nicest guy in the world, but he's just wrong for the role, and that movie will be worse because they just stuck a random big-name star who can't do voices in the lead role. And that's just yeah. a shame. Yeah, I don't I don't think he's that... I don't think Chris Pratt's that nice of a guy. I think we've talked a little bit about him being a little bit of a jerk. Yeah, so that doesn't help either. I think he's pretty... Not crazy Christian, but a little bit Christian, and in, in general, there's nothing wrong with that sort of belief, but sometimes people like that have certain traits that they annoy others with. Uh, that is true, and, you know, they may not mind when, for instance, different groups of people have their, their rights limited or whatever. Right. Which he never, he never just openly says to do those things. He's not that bad, like, say, a certain uh, former rapper guy who's gone quite <laughs> insane. Yeah, he's uh, pretty. He's quite the attention hog. Yes, so he's not that bad, but like people can just detect. Like he gives off this feeling, like he has those problems, for sure, or those beliefs or whatever. What's to say? Oh yeah, Mysteries? I'm not. I'm not too hyped on the Mario movie. I don't. I've really. Yeah, I, I can't do movies where actors are not doing voices anymore. Yeah, I'm there with you. Like, it, it just makes me think of, like, Shrek or something, you know? It's like, um, which, not that the Shrek movies are all bad. You know, part three is quite bad. But it just makes me think of, like, generic animated film, and it doesn't make me feel like, oh, finally, this is the Mario movie we've always deserved. Or right. But, I mean, I Mike like Myers Shrek at least one. did, did yeah, his. Yeah, one's fine. Okay. Scottish accent. And the voices weren't bad. Yeah, they're not yeah so even good. Mike Myers is doing a voice. But, yeah, and I mean, Eddie like, Murphy's doing a little bit of one. He's a little bit more hyper loud than regular Eddie Murphy. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Okay, where am I supposed to go? Down Back here? Back up. Why'd you go down after you got that? Well, because it, it's pointing oh, down it's pointing here. Oh, down. You must have... Yeah, you're right. You must have... But I don't... Um, I, yeah, I don't see a way to actually... the other way and further I down. I do? Okay, yeah. gotcha. But, I um, mean, is it any worse than, like, you know, I guess Michael Caine being in the Cider House Rules and he has the friggin', you know... British accent in New England. That's a or, well. I mean, it's a live action movie. Or Kevin you know, Costner as Robin Hood. Robin Hood, yeah. Kevin Some Costner people really don't Hood. like Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves, because of that. But I, I can roll uh, with that. I'm just saying that there's. I but mean, it, there's people cast all the time for who they are and not for who the voice is. That is a fair even point. In live action. But you know. Um, gosh, in animation, there is like a whole world of profession. There exists a whole world of professional voice actors. Oh yeah. And everybody, for instance, a lot of people wish that Mario was being played by Charles Martinet, who is a professional voice actor. Go down. And Why didn't you go down oh, to the left? Can't you go that way? I I don't think so. But let's let's go look. Okay. Sorry. Down. All the way down. Yeah, down and to the left. Down to the left. Okay, yeah, maybe I'm just not... I'll just walk off this edge here. Nope. Oh, I can jump down right there. Okay. That's what I was missing, Tyler. Yeah, I can tell. How about this? Now I walk through the house? Can you pick up so, that cow? Yeah, I walked in the house. All right. <laughs> back, to the, yeah. back to the Guardians trailer. Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah. Someone okay. said they were going to cry during it. I, I won't cry during it, but... Like, I don't know. I get to, You can tell someone's going to die. Like, someone's definitely yes. dying in that movie. And yeah, I think they're... it's going to be Rocket. My money's really? on Rocket. Oh, yeah. man. That, they could kill Rocket off easily because he's animated and all that. Yeah. My but money's on Rocket. Because he's, look at the... He's old for a raccoon. I mean, I know he's... Well, but he's been genetically manipulated. And in fact, Tyler, we were watching an, an About video because there's a lot of things you could miss just watching the trailer if you haven't read about what's going on in the new movie. He looks le more like a normal group. But yeah, there's this uh -huh. alternate Earth. It's called Counter-Earth. And it's... On this, this guy, I think the High Evolutionary is that his name? He has genetically engineered a bunch of animal people, and Rocket is probably created by him specifically. Interesting. Yeah, so it's... interesting stuff. And you might not just be able to gather that from watching a trailer real quickly. Remind me to ask no. you a question sure. after the stream about Guardians. But I guess there, yes. I guess there was like a seal in it. Didn't he hug it like an otter or something in the trailer? Did he? Oh. Yeah, like uh, the character. That's a character named Lila. Apparently, like I got in a little they bit of a, dis <laughs> a disagreement so with somebody is a in the Facebook group. Raccoon and other stuff, isn't she? I have no idea. <laughs> I've well. never even heard of her. Yeah, like I've read some Guardians comics, but none that reveal the character named that or anything. And in I fact, the Guardians. Pa. I have a Funko Ooh. Pop of her. I'm pretty sure she's not a. a oh, daughter. neat. Okay, Bye yeah, you're Bye probably Bye right Bye. then. No, it's Groot won't die, Icky, because if they were going to kill Groot, they could have already, and then they just turned him into another plant, so he but can't why, die. why does Groot have to look so bad? Like, Groot why did they go horrible. with this he design? He doesn't look bad in this one. No, it's, yeah, it's the same design. Like a, he still, still looks buff. like a linebacker. Yeah, he's Swole Groot, or what are people calling him? Like, but Swole Groot or that, Buff Groot? Groot. But they said that it's not really Groot. It's like Groot's son. Well, yes, but we still call him Groot. He doesn't have a different name. Well, he's still no, just Groot. No, but he's different. Yeah, he's not the original group, but I just don't understand why he has to look that way. Why do you have to What's the benefit? He looks like a guy in a suit when he's actually computer generated. Why? The lingering memories of I don't like it either. So Darth Vader, I think Jordan's that here. He that yeah, Jordan's been here. Dave oh. Batista. Jordan Batista bomb. Is that the name of your wrestling move, Jordan? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Dave Batista won't die. Drax won't die. He's not important Drax. enough. Well, he's expressed that he is wanting to retire from the role because he's getting older and he doesn't want to have to keep in in that level of shape. But actually, in the trailer, we see him wearing shirts, which means he could actually, like, Not if they would... Be crazy yeah. good shape. Yeah, exactly. If they'll let him wear shirts, then he doesn't have to be insanely they in shape. They can CGI so. muscles on He him. has a contract to always to. wear a shirt now. Does he really, I made? Wow, even on the ride. Yeah, but no, I don't think that's a bad thing. Yes, the regular character of Drax is known to be shirtless, right? But it's okay to wear clothes sometimes, yeah, too. Yeah, that's fine. Or like a, a vest or something, I don't know. Yeah, who cares? That's fine. Um, I don't know. Drax isn't much of a character. He's kind of like a comic relief. 
Yeah, but he's so fun in the Christmas special. Yeah, so dumb. But that makes him fun. <laughs> oh yeah, you like the Christmas special. I forgot about that. Everyone likes the Christmas special. Tyler Not Williams. everyone likes the Christmas special. Oh, you're being such a Grinch. Corny and the music's not that good. Uh, the music was pretty good. What are you talking it's about? Just, just Who else could get Kevin Bacon to run away from people? That's what I'm just saying. Let's do a quick poll, everybody. How many of you enjoyed the Guardians Christmas special? Please let us know. I and is it's... the music any good? Because there should be a way to it. like really do a poll. There I probably is with a bot or something. Yeah, uh, our bot probably has that kind of support. We just don't know it because we never look at stuff. Yes, I loved it too. And by the way, we're getting ready to watch it again with some friends tomorrow. In your yeah. face, Tyler. Oh, I'm sorry. Gosh, <laughs> oh, second God. time. Uh -huh. And a third, and a fourth. Classic and a Tyler. Hey, I liked. Oh. I liked one movie I saw in 2005 once. <laughs> Jono, why? Uh, yes, why haven't you seen it? Because Jono, don't you like me give Brownmeister a little a little crap for? N for not watching the Marvel things, and, and now you haven't seen the Christmas special? It's not right. You're slacking. I forgot how to start a poll. <laughs> uh, there's gotta be a way. Exclamation part poll? Yeah. Vin yes, Vin Diesel plays Groot's voice, yeah. but he sure doesn't play the goofy buff new no, form of Groot. Weird. Just hasn't had a chance. It's only like 47 minutes, Jono, so I, I highly recommend that you make the time for it. That's like one and a half episodes of a short show. Or maybe even just two episodes of a show. But much less than a movie. I'll give you the music. I didn't think it was very original. But I thought it was fine. I don't think it was horrible. I mean, like, well, they actually had a new Christmas song or two, like written yeah. just for the, mo for the special, and they're funny. So that wasn't bad. So. They didn't have Feliz Navidad, though. I think that's Tyler's main concern, and I am in full agreement there. That's right. I also don't like Craglin. I don't know why. I just can't bring myself to like Craglin. But he's played he by Sean Gunn, James Gunn's I brother. Know he is. That's yeah. The yeah, the oh, Finn. Yeah. He's actually he also, a pretty good actor. Yeah, he is. I like I think I've seen him other stuff. Don't mind him. I, don't, I don't like Craglin for some reason. Aww. Maybe maybe he'll finally have uh, row on me in three. I like him because he was he was really loyal to Yondu when he didn't have to be, you know? Like, uh, that loyalty is a nice trait. He also I does, really I like think it. he does, like, the fill-ins for Rocket, and, like, in Avengers and stuff. He's really? Like that. Wow, yeah. neat. Because they need someone to oh, nice. have, like, a computer to pick up or whatever. Yeah, the Smashing Pumpkins Christmas song. Thank you, I made. And, Jono, just, just consider it, like, Guardians of the Galaxy 2.5, you know? Like, you don't even have to worry about the specific Christmas theme. It probably makes Jono feel bad that during Christmas it's very warm in Australia, so they don't get snow and stuff like we do. So I, I understand feeling left out about that. Jono's in a bad mood because Australia lost in the World Cup today. Uh, but didn't didn't the U.S. also? So did America. So we're yeah, with you there. Thanks to the Netherlish. That's who. That's hey. That's my heritage. That's my other team. <laughs> oh really? Both my grand. Two of my grandparents were born there. Ah. Uh. So if it wasn't for them, we might have won. Thanks, Tyler. The, the U.S. wasn't going anywhere. The way oh, man. How, long, how, long, <laughs> how much longer is it going to go on? Because uh, I just want to stop, you know, telling my kids 18 times for a period that, no, they can't watch the World Cup because that's not biology. Yeah, like two my weeks, kids... Two weeks from tomorrow is the man. final. My kids won't shut up about it, but Brandy's kids actually try to watch it during her class yeah. because that's how bad they are. And it's they're like... Well, other teachers are letting us watch it, and I'm like, I'm a biology teacher. But I huh. think because the U.S. did pretty well in this World Cup, Tyler, I think they actually did pretty well. Yeah, I they made that... it. They made it to where they usually make it. Yeah, they, I mean, they, they got out of the first round, which is always good. Yeah, I mean, it's bound to help U.S. interest in soccer a bit, I would think. Vote now by saying nay or yes. Oh, wow, what does that do? What are we voting for? That is the, if you like the Guardian, the, ga ga nay. the Guardian of okay. the... Okay, is Tyler's taste in Guardians of the Galaxy related Christmas specials? That's fully voted with your vote bad. counting for... Why does my vote only count for one vote? That's not fair. <laughs> I should get like five. <laughs> what are you... Tyler thinks he, he owns Twitter now or something. That's right. Anyway, I don't see how to get down over there. 
Tyler, help me out here because I'm not good at the pathfinding in this game, and you are better yeah, at it. These guys are voting the after the deadlines. They're counting <laughs> mail-in votes that didn't even get there on time. <laughs> These guys are... It's rigged. There's nothing I can do. It's rigged. Sure. So, old nine. I really, I really won the vote. If you count all the legal votes, I won easily. Oh, God, Tyler. Oh, my gosh. I think we know who you're aspiring oh, to be I like. Oh, it successfully voted. It whispered. Oh, they're from Texas. That's neat. Oh, my gosh. Somebody in the audience, please help me out with this. I don't want to be stuck. I'm having such fun with the conversation, but... You have to, like, say yes or nay and like, hurry because oh it's almost gosh. done. Yeah. But I don't know even know what we're voting for. We have to establish what, what we're voting for before this, we ask the them. The Christmas special. But, but what does each one mean? Is yay that it's awesome? Yes is good. Nay is bad. Ah, fine. Nope. In your yes. face, Tyler. Yes. You can vote more than once. <laughs> that No, can you seriously vote more than once? <laughs> or does it not count? It better not count. I don't count. know. I, I keep getting notifications that my vote counted. Yep. Your vote is trash, Tyler. No, it doesn't count. Thank you, Icky. Oh. How hey. time somebody looked out for the integrity of the stream. Who said uh, besides, besides Tyler? More no, election, dude. more election That's rigging, more vote rigging. I Other thought Tyler's. I could finally get away from this. <laughs> for even Tyler. I have great taste in movies. Even Darker Player thinks you have bad taste in movies. That's I not great taste in whispering to me. Oh, the, I mean, like, sometimes our, our tastes align, but you, you are kind of a little bit negative I'm more, in general. I'm more critical than the typical mindless viewer who, does, who just goes uh, in and enjoys everything. I'm pretty critical of movies. Like, actually, when we have, you know, Galadrius is not here this week, but... I actually think he needs to be more critical of things he likes because he's very not critical Lush if he likes it. Way. I really don't remember but, Flushed oh, Away at all. Crap. It's a great that movie. A, it's fun. That is a creepy. Those characters are creepy looking. Well, they're, they're stop very, motion animation. Or, very aren't 2006 they... animation. Something yeah, like either that. they're stop motion or they're CG made to look stop motion. Well, they're, motion. Too, they're a little humanoid looking for... for... Oh, here's, here's where. Thank you. I think I found it. Oh, we got a pushable object here. Wait, what's over here to the right? Let me check that first. Was there anything else? Oh, oh look. Yeah, there's more pushable stuff. Finally, some progress. No thanks to yes, Tyler. Yes, progress. I don't know. This isn't my type of game. You need Brian here. That's kind of crap. <laughs> That's true. He would have been a good co-host. But no, I mean, you helped me out earlier, though. Yeah. So, yes, we think the Guardian's Christmas special was no good. That's <laughs> Tyler, I think democratically you failed this one. So I could push what, this boat to left, but I don't see the point of it. What's democracy? I don't know what that is. <laughs> You're like, uh, actually... No. Mm -hmm. We won't pick on you, Tyler. You've got Mitt Romney. He stands up for democracy sometimes. That's right. I got Mitt. <laughs> Baseball Mitt, as he likes to be called. Baseball Mitt? Mm hmm his name's Mitt, so his nickname is Baseball Mitt. Okay. Anyway. What about um, a catcher's mitt? Hmm. Could be catcher's mitt. Yeah, does anybody call him that, Tyler? Oh, look, I just found a new thing. I don't call him anything. Jeez. I mean, he's local to you. Guess. You should be friends. I know. <laughs> he, has to run. he has to run for election in two years. Ah. Uh. Oh, look, I, I found the... Yay! Two, maybe it's four. I'm opening the gate. Booyah. Man, this game is so interesting, and I wish I lived a life where I had time to just play whatever game I wanted for as long as I wanted, because I would totally keep stick with it. But instead, I can barely play anything. This remembering thing is weird. You have to catch the ghost jellyfish that comes out, and then it... Gives you some kind of flashback or something. More remembers the heat on her tongue and fingers. Okay. Well, guys, you don't have to stop chatting just because we had a poll. Tyler, you totally killed the chat. Whatever. Once again, you killed it. You killed it by bringing up that stupid Guardians of the Galaxy Christmas special. Oh, you're so wrong. So uh, earlier, Darker Player and maybe somebody else mentioned the new Transformers trailer. We we have you seen it? I didn't watch it. Though. It looks like I... there's a looks like there's a monkey. Like the beasts or something. Yeah, see, 
It's weird because it's like a semi sequel to Bumblebee, I think, which is the only good live action Transformers movie they've made. But it is also. Oh, just barely. And by the See? way, the, the See, sequels... you're being critical, and I'm enjoying a movie. The sequels retroactively made that movie worse. And by the way, the robots are always hideous monstrosities, even in that one. Focus is taking too many victims today. You know those robots are ugly, Tyler. You know that they were... No, in the first one? They were ugly in the drawings, too, right? Compare Jazz and Megatron. No, no, the the cartoons... No, are, they, they beautiful were big artwork. and ugly and bulky, and they looked just like that. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah. Bumblebee is the only one where they look anything like the actual cartoon Transformers. It's true. I know Transformers pretty well. Remember, I traveled out of state to multiple Transformers conventions. That's an amoeba. Beastmaster. Hey, we got the 4K Blu-ray of that, and we haven't watched it. Yeah. Man, we really should. The first time she saw but the anyway, yeah, this one has the has Beast Wars things in it, Tyler, which is the animal Transformers. Oh. Yeah, it's interesting because Beast Wars actually takes place thousands of years in the future of regular Transformers, where, like, the regular Transformers are long dead and such. Oh, so that? Optimus Prime isn't going to be in it? Well, no, he is going to be in this movie because it's not necessarily canonical, you know? Gotcha. Um, yeah, because I can't take him out of the movie. Canonical. <laughs> no. And he's still played by Peter Cullen and everything. Canonical or Peter Cullen is still alive, oh, but we lose Kevin thoughts. Conroy. What kind of How is that? How do robots die? Once once again. Again. Well, they have souls. They have a spark, and that's their soul. Oh, so the all spark goes out. Yes. Yeah, so, well, some, the spark goes out, not the all spark. That that's a different thing. Berries. But oh, but yeah, like if in general they can taste. rarely be resuscitated after actually dying. Isn't the all spark where they got their spark? Do a poll. What's cooler, the all spark or the tesseract? <laughs> the tesseract. The tesseract from from Captain America. Yes. They look the same. <laughs> Okay, but it's still a Tesseract, even though the Tesseract isn't that cool. <laughs> tesseract. Okay, where am I supposed to go? I'm up there, to the left. Heavy padlock. Man, this is just darn interesting. Tyler, are you saying this game is too adventure for you? You like puzzles. I yeah, don't, it's a little adventure for me. I don't care for puzzles very much. Well, she would get frustrated. That would be my only concern. She gets frustrated easily. But I bet she would like... Other than that, she would like it. Oh, yeah, there's a new trailer out for The Last of Us. Like, the final the show? trailer. Yeah, for the show. How's it look? I didn't watch it. I only watched the the teaser from a while ago. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's I haven't okay. watched any of it. I still haven't played even one of those games. Yeah, they're they're not as great as everyone thinks they are. Really? They're kind of slow. They're, they're too, yeah, they're too adventure explorer There's not enough shooting. Pow, pow. And they just, they just keep remaking them, too. Make something new. <laughs> they do. Twelve <laughs> remakes of the first Last of Us. Because they know it'll sell. Did the, do you think the new remake sold that well? Didn't it already come out? I think so. I think they always sell really well. It's the kind of thing I made would play. I made, did you play the new Last of Us remake? Dark I'm a, my cats I mean... are too lazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, yeah, Brian doesn't like it, but d Brian doesn't like it because of the story or something. He doesn't like it's it because of the story. Yeah, a lot like of people Brian... wanted it to be like the old world choose grows. your own ending, Dream and you don't get the ending that the game made. Like once more. I could see the that. first one. I don't know. I have a second one. Well. Brian doesn't like horror things. Like he really doesn't like them, as I understand it. Am I right, Brian? So yeah, the the story is really the only redeeming part of that game. For us, it's not but isn't it pretty Vote depressing? Vote for the Tesseract. Vote for the Tesseract. Yeah, it's real depressing. I don't know. It's what are we? Poll. Did he just run a new poll? So how do we vote yeah. for it? What do we type to vote for it? You just have to click, click. click. Which is cooler? Or which is cooler? Tesseract. Tesseract. Yeah, but he's it should be all spark. Tyler. Yeah, it's I mean, the all it's, spark, but it's all it's good. How did you do that? That's cool. Yeah, you gotta it's teach like us. A, it's like an interactive one now. You can like, you can like hit the little arrow. And it's like, oh, interesting. Like Brian doesn't say it's. Brian says it's not too scary. He just really doesn't like the story. 
it's only three votes. You guys, you gotta get it. You gotta be more interactive. Yeah, that's true, guys. We're we're putting on the stream for you. You know, it takes a lot of effort to put on the stream. You could just you could do us a favor and vote when we run a poll, please. Gotta okay, vote in the poll. I'm a, it's yeah. Sixty-six point six 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 six. I'll do the first. It wasn't easy to figure out how to do that poll. Yeah, Icky is the genius. One eight is point one two five. Uh oh. That ladder is not going the way I want it to. Yeah, why not? I mean, if instead of remaking part one 12 times, why not remake the second one? Didn't they? They I did already make, remake the second one. I think both of them have been remade on PS5. Have they both been remade? I no. So. On PS5? No. Yeah. Tesseract is better in one. I agree. Maybe, maybe the PS5 yeah. one was more of like a enhanced than a remake. All right. Hey, still, Holy Drew, look. They definitely did release the PS5 version at a second time, at a separate time from the PS4 version. So they could capitalize on double sales. I see, but not a true remake, just an enhanced version. Not. Yeah, something like that. That's yeah, fair, that's fair. Like black sales. Tyler, what did you watch this week since you weren't watching cool shows like Willow? Uh, World Cup Soccer. Really? Yeah, I watch a lot of soccer. I like the World Cup. It's With fun. friends or by yourself? By myself. It's all it's all early in the morning. The oh, the yeah, that's true. Yeah, during the school day for us, that's what we hate about it. Yeah. Uh oh. Yeah, hey, yeah. Someone's floor. Who the heck typed that, Brian? Are you just add adding random things, or did someone try to say that? Oh, wow. He's banning, deleting some weird terms. The berry farmer's sign. <laughs> Exhausted yeah. from Yeah. The heck, struggle. Brian. Living things are his purview. Wait. You're purging them. Who put that in? in um, I actually don't want people saying the F word in, in chat, so I that's what actually... That was, I think that it was... It was, was permitted. Who? before or something. No, somebody oh, allowed it. Yeah, it was permitted. Yeah, weird. Yeah, that's weird. Oh, weird. Maybe I did it. Could have been Icky. Icky's a big Sounds potty like mouth. <laughs> Does it? I promise I did not go in there and do oh it, even gosh. though I am a big potty mouth. <laughs> it's seriously. He I know Brandy's always. All the Brandy's time. always like, show us your, your whatever, and I'm like, Brandy. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even like whatever. girls. Why are, you, why are you saying that? I don't show think I. Show me your credit card. <laughs> <laughs> show yeah, me your credit card. Sure. That'll turn a girl on. She's not a toy. I don't think I watched anything. I watched Wolf, West Wing. I don't watch. We rewatched West Wing. That's good. Really Thank you for checking, Brian. For heaven's sake, was, was I meant, I meant to just watch? watch? As the poisonous dust slowly settles. So this is her uncle. We finally Why reached another character, suit? Tyler. That's pretty well, because of the spores. Like they will kill him. Inside. Why is she not wearing any? I yeah. guess her her scarf is protecting her, but it's not over her nose. Uh, she's not wearing her mask right. Yeah. It, oh, I know. Nothing makes you look dumber than wearing a mask incorrectly. Oh my god, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'll have it. <laughs> Thank you. I mean, yeah, we try, and you do the same thing, which we appreciate. Yeah, like we we like some innuendo because we are adults, so we can't help it. But still, yeah, we want kids to be able to watch a stream and not come away scarred for life or anything. Well, no, I'm not gonna teach them what I teach them to do the way that it should. But looks like the did you play any games this week? Anything. Um, I don't think so. Yes, this really part of the island is protected again. I didn't really do a lot of anything this week. Besides buy stuff. Well, I did buy, I mostly bought stuff. Let's see. Oh, I had Last to week, right? Week. Or, yeah, you, well, there was Cyber Monday. Yeah, I had to work a lot this week. Why is that? Because of being Jay, off last week? Just busy and stuff like that. Okay, are you still doing all right at work? Yeah, I'm doing good. Good. No disagreements. So no, I don't really have to work with anyone. It's great. I just do what that thing that is pretty you sweet. Where to go. Yeah, it is. Is, that what it is. Yeah, it points in the general okay. direction of the destination. Interesting. So I gotta find a way to lower that. Is it so just using this wheel? No, it's $20. not using this wheel. Oh boy. We'll see if I can figure it out. I want to be break. Yeah, I could have reviewed Goat Simulator 3, but I was just too busy. I couldn't ask for it or anything. That's a shame. Yeah, we've got nine days. That's all. Yeah, I'm Royal Bob say. is a form of nine. teacher. Only nine. 
Oh yeah, till we have Christmas break for two weeks. You know, the Thanksgiving week for me, I got to write a lot of articles, which is good because I usually feel kind of guilty about not. Because for better or worse, I'm almost the only one writing articles for our site. And it's nice to have that level of power, but it just makes me sad when there's not articles up and when there's news coming in that we should be covering and we're not. And I tried to get them to hire somebody new to help out, and they wouldn't, so it's just all on my shoulders. Yeah, the 17th... No, um... Yeah, the yeah. holiday stream, that's the first day of our holiday break, right? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Yeah. You get, like, two and a half weeks off? Well, actually, I have to go back January 2nd or second. 3rd. Yeah, January 2nd, which I is ridiculous. That's when everyone goes back. I have to go oh, well, sec going back to second is ridiculous. That's yeah, like teachers usually would go back on the third or the fourth. Or, yeah, the yeah, exactly. Is, is New Year's Day. Um, I have PD I, on the not... third. Have... Dang, Thyrenia. PD on the third. You had the ladder signed, lined up and you didn't climb it. Um. Well, the thing is, I need to go to the right, so I'm. I'm not doing the right thing. I'm just kind of fidgeting, but. 28. I made. What do you do for a living? Is that pub common knowledge? Yeah, homie Drew, everybody, just so you know, that is a thing we should talk about, so thank you for asking. Yes, on December 17th, Saturday, December 17th, we are doing our annual holiday stream where we play Jack, the latest Jackbox Party Pack game with you guys, and we just, we exchange a few gifts, and we just have a nice party atmosphere, low, low stress. I don't have to, like, even play the game if I don't want to, so I can concentrate fully on chat. And we'll have like all our co-hosts on mic, and we'll have some webcam views. So Tyler better be ready for that. Oh. And uh, <laughs> yeah, we'll have Brian on mic as long as he's available. Oh yeah, Tyler, you're gonna be you're gonna be arriving late, actually, as I recall. Oh yeah, I will be late. Yes. Yeah, you let I me know in advance, which is thoughtful. I have a family thing. As long as you show up before we stop, it'll be okay. Oh, oh cool. look at that! She can float down. I didn't know that was a mechanic. Maybe that's how I have to get across. Let me go try that. I'm sorry about the health problems, Brian. You should, you know, keep us apprised to let us know how you are doing in general. Well, that's a good idea. Have my hot tub ready to go. Okay, I'm gonna run and jump in. Well, the holiday and... stream. <laughs> so you're. Oh, wait, you're. Uh... Okay. Is this actually gonna get me across anywhere? It may not be family friendly anymore. Uh, yeah, maybe not. There's Bob. Yeah, we will definitely have less holiday codes this stream compared to most years. We'll have as many as we ever have for any regular stream, but I wouldn't count on like every single person getting a gift this year. Because unfortunately I've been busier with work than average, and I just have not had the time to, to hustle for codes quite as much as I would like. Hustle for codes? Yeah, I mean, it's a lot of negotiating and begging to get the codes that we have, and I still do. I know, it's just, it's the way you said it. It's like... Can anyone tell how, how where I'm supposed to go? I'm not seeing how to do this. See, there's a ladder there. I need to make it come down, and then I could come across. Yo no sé. Oh, thank you. I made, if, if you'll remind me, maybe I could do that. That's good to hear. I don't know if we've ever done a Cubite stream, actually. But yeah, in many years we'll have, like, I mean, not to make us look bad this year or something, but like, many years we'll have, like, 50 plus codes for the holiday stream, and this year I'm just promising 10 or more. And we, we like to have cameos, like, I'll, I pay for cameos for some of our favorite co-hosts and such. We hopefully will have at least one or two of those, but maybe not as many as last year. We had a bunch last year, and they were great. Tom didn't cool. appreciate his enough, not, though, Tyler. They're not cheap. Yeah, no, they're they're mostly not cheap. Icky's was cheap, and her, that one was fun, I thought. The lady doing no. magic. Oh, yeah. I don't remember Tom's. Tom's was uh, actually a voice actress from The Last of Us. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, yeah. She was like... <laughs> she was young and... Uh, I, I feel like I knew who she was or something. Like I think something. I, out of all the ones we got last last year, hers was probably the, the least impressive, but it, it wasn't because she did anything uh -oh. wrong. She did, she's just like, she's so young and she didn't have much presence, maybe. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I remember. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't see where to go. That's a shame. I, uh, Sperry, I don't know where to go from here, so I, I'm kind of at... 
I cannot stand getting stuck in games. So this is sort of the end of my enjoyment of the game. This game is brilliant, though. Like, the the art is amazing, and the story is interesting. For an adventure game, it's really good. And it's got platforming. Tyler, you like the platforming. Barely Look, I'm jumping, platforming. see? Yeah, you barely figured that out. <laughs> good. And that's not platforming. Yeah, but anyway, guys, as far as the holiday stream goes... If you could try to plan to attend, we really like to hang out and play Jackbox with you guys. Like, I look forward to it all year long. Like, those interactive streams, we don't do that many of them. You know, I wish, kind of wish we could do more. But... You should see Paul's calendar. Like, he's like, eight <laughs> more days until Jackbox holiday stream. But he does it, like, starting at, like, 300 days. So, he just oh, gets a calendar just for that. How did you know? I have my own advent calendar for it. That's right. And, uh, yeah, like, the... the particular day of the stream it's circled like 19 times you know it's just like tons of circles and arrows yeah to it. hearts and stuff yeah <laughs> but yeah it is a nice day uh, of course bob you know bob you you often say you're somewhere like you know it, it's okay to just watch the stream like just put it on your phone or something even though you're doing something else we we don't mind um yeah i like how she floats but i don't like annoyed. how i can't figure out where to go i'm quite annoyed by that. Maybe I could go downward. I'll go down, but anyway. Yep, no. There's no easy way to go there. Thing. Is there anything else we wanted to talk about, Tyler? Uh, I think we went through all the, the, the core mouse movies that we needed to talk about for this week. <laughs> That's true. We we really we'll get some new. We'll do like an in depth look at Stuart Little too on the next one. <laughs> That's not, not such a bad idea. It's just like an hour and a half of of critical analysis on Stuart Little too. Why the heck not? Yeah, we've That's talked about doing the all viewers the viewers <laughs> They certainly don't want a big mix of Sega Genesis games for some reason. Yeah, they didn't like that. Hard uh... to imagine why Sega Genesis is maybe if it was a Super Nintendo stream everyone would have showed up uh yeah you know we didn't even do a super well no one time i did like a super nes classics pre-stream i think relief washes over her uncle at the sight of her success yeah like i said darker player let's only count on there being 10 if we can get more than 10 then we're doing well but i just don't have as much time this year oh um but for next week i might just buy the new dragon quest game that's coming out the day before and we might just stream that with random prizes tyler if you don't mind. Uh, you said next week? Yeah, this coming Saturday. Yeah. I mean, it comes out I'm on the not, 9th, so. I'm not a... What game? Sorry. I Dragon Quest that. Treasures. I don't know what that is. Is that a phone game? No, it's just a... It's a Switch game. Oh, Monster but, Hunter Rise is coming to new consoles. That's something. Oh, yeah, that is pretty cool. Are you actually going to play it? Yeah, I played Monster Hunter World. Thank the audience first. Do I thank you or the audience first? I thank you first. Of course I do. I'm just yeah, like, I'm wow. always first. I'm befuddled because of this friggin' adventure game, man. So, Tyler, thanks for hanging out and being an awesome co-host like you usually are. Yeah, happy to be here. <laughs> Brandy, thanks for sitting along with us. Yep. Let me let me find some some good streamer to raid. <laughs> yeah, please do. Thank you to Icky for running the contest. He did a terrific job as always. He is the best of the best. Thanks to all of you guys for hanging out with us, even though we got super stuck in this otherwise beautiful game. Thanks to our subscribers, including Jono, our very first subscriber, Perfect Zero, like our second subscriber, Thyrenia, Brandy Cats, and many others for you know keeping the stream going financially. That is a huge help, and we love you for it. So. Don't forget, Saturday Game School takes place every Saturday at 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Pacific. We always stream a different game. We always give out cool prizes. We have our holiday stream coming up on December 17th. Please look forward to that. We'll see you next week, guys. We love you. And remember, don't hate. Appreciate. See you, guys. Bye. Not out. I'll hold those little SOPs. Oh, scary. Okay. <laughs> yeah, Just playing a video game. No one wants to see that. Uh, Which... I, don't, I don't think people would mind. Give me some light of raid, Tyler. Thanks don't to No to Time for Games. Don't we have to say goodbye to everyone oh. first? Yeah, yeah, let's say goodbye to all our friends. Who we got? Yeah, there's...
think there's two underscores in there. Okay, Thyrenia and Wolfie are both here, even though they're working super long, 55-hour weeks. Thank you guys so much. Thank you, yep. we'll try that. Yeah, Perfect Sheen Zero. Here. Martin Sheen stopped by, and his son Charlie and Emilio, they were here for a minute. Thank you uh, guys. 